feel like it was a little bit more than what it was the last time you had some discomfort in that forearm? Uh, yeah, yesterday it just kind of got progressively worse to the point where I was feeling pain with hitters in the box, which I hadn't felt, I've never felt that in my life because normally when the hitter comes in there, just adrenaline takes over and pain goes away. So that was kind of a bad sign. I kind of had an eerie feeling, but I thought the worst it would be would be like a partial strain in UCL. Like I thought it was just still muscle, maybe a little bit ligament damage, but Doc said it was a full tear, pretty straightforward. So hugely disappointing and, you know, just set back, but got a new got a new path to take here just got to rehab and get back to be stronger than I went up, uh, was before so it's really really tough day will there be surgery Brent uh, yes yeah. Yeah. When, do they know when yet uh, we haven't scheduled yet uh, dr. Rosh has told me you know take a couple days to try to figure out uh, what you want to do when you want to do it all that but uh, it's kind of just today's process and looking at the options and all that I'm not sure if we're gonna take a second opinion or not he said and he showed me too. It was pretty straightforward. There's a, a tear. It's just you know, the UCL is torn. So um, just kind of kind of take it hour by hour, if you will. It was pretty crushing news, but kind of starting to accept it a little bit and just trying to take a big perspective, like you know, be grateful for what I have and all that. But it's it's tough news at the same time. After seeing teammates sort of go through this process, do you feel like you have a sense of what lies ahead? Yeah, for sure. Um, and there have been some good success stories even on our team right now. So um, that's that's something I'm going to lean on for sure. I lean on those guys for advice and kind of for their inspiration, like how they've come back and been successful. So um, yeah, I'm definitely going to be uh, using those guys as, as pick me ups and all that. Sure. Do you know how many hitters you faced maybe with the torn yesterday? Um, I was I don't remember it. Like there wasn't a pitch yesterday that I felt it like just go. It just kind of just got progressively worse. Um, but I don't. You know, to be honest, I don't know if what happened that first time I did in the Twins game. Maybe that I don't even know if that was when it happened or whatnot. But it was one of those things. I was just managing the soreness and we were like working through it. And we still like I just thought it was muscle. And then yesterday, just with all the signs were like, well, this is might be the muscle still not healed. And then. Today it was like what torn UCL kind of like so it was just kind of one of those things that I didn't feel one pitch event yesterday. It just by the third inning it was just really painful every pitch. Do you know Brent. where you're going to have a time? Um, I don't know where yet either. Yeah, I'm just kind of still looking at the object. I called my agent and all that, and we're gonna do all that. But uh, just hopefully go with someone you know we trust and at the time that's right. I guess that's all I can say right now. Just for the, the role that you've had on this team this year and the value that you've had with the starts that you've given them, how disappointing is it for your season to end, you know, at this at this point in the season? Uh, yeah, hugely disappointing. I mean, uh, I didn't really give our team a chance to win yesterday either, so that was uh, just kind of some other pain to boot. But um, like you said, I've, I've been able to contribute and help help us win some games here, and that kind of something to feel good about on the year. And the team's still in a good place, so that's something to feel really good about. But um, at the same time, we, we're going through a tough time right now, and unfortunately, I kind of added to it with the game yesterday and all that. But uh, you know, we we got to keep keep picking each other up.